in today's video i'm gonna show you how to overlay your live comments or overlay your chat while live streaming on twitch using obs for free basically i'm gonna show you this cool tool called social stream ninja to be able to show all your comments on screen in obs so let's not take much time let's get right into it what's up guys my name is sam live production tips and tools if you're not here make sure you hit the subscribe button and let's navigate the live streaming world together if you live stream on twitch and you use obs to actually live stream there's a cool tool that i want to show to you that you can use to overlay the comments and basically this social chat tool was created by this guy called steve so i'm gonna link down below his youtube channel so you can check him out it's a google chrome extension so basically you're gonna be able to use it either on mac or pc as long as you're using chrome browser so let's go ahead through the steps on how to install it so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put a link to the download page right now in my description so all you have to do is just go to that link it's gonna take you to the download page okay so once you click to it, you're gonna get to a page that looks like this by the way i'm gonna put even like download link that you can actually click when you click to it it's going to directly download the file so you don't need to kind of pass through the page but if you want to pass through the page this is what you're gonna get okay this is steve the guy who made the chat too and you're gonna go on the top here okay code you're gonna go to download uh the zip file okay so let's go ahead and download it okay so once you download it you're gonna get this little file into your download folder the next thing you have to do you're gonna go to open your chrome browser you know as usual go to extensions and let's go to manage extension so once you have access to your extensions what you're gonna do go to developer mode okay so it's important you have to toggle this it has to be on developer mode okay very important once you're there it's gonna give you these options here load and pack okay click uh, the folder that we downloaded and you should be able to install it and as you can see now it's working okay it's kind of installed so this is what it looks like now to be able to use it and be able to actually see it here on the top as you can see if i go to my extension icon here it's right here okay so as you can see it shows up here now to be able to have it already kind of ready for you you need to click this pin kind of thing so you're gonna be able to pin it right here you're gonna click here as you can see the icon is already here and you have two links the first one is the dockable stream chat link which is the link that you are going to use uh to you know to be able to see the messages coming in okay the second link is the one that is actually going to embed or bring in uh, every single chat so you're gonna see it in a moment in obs but for now we're gonna go ahead and actually before we do anything another very very important step is to be able to click enable extension okay so if it's not enabled nothing is gonna happen okay so let's go ahead and click enable extension and as you can see it becomes uh, a little green so now that we have the extension working actually we're gonna go ahead and click the extension right here so as you can see this is what it looks like uh, i was already live streaming on facebook so these are, are some of my messages coming from facebook so again if you are interested to know how to do the same thing on facebook live i'm gonna put a link to the video down below because you can use this tool for both facebook and twitch and youtube at the same time so i can do everything for free guys okay and the cool part about it you don't even have to log in using this extension so basically you can just do it without having to give it access to your staff right so this is really cool so once you have it installed make sure it's enabled and everything the first link is the one you're gonna need to create a doc in your obs and the second one is the one you're going to use to actually create a browser source that's going to use to show messages okay so now if i go back to obs as you can see it's already set up i already have the doc and i have the chat overlay already in obs but i'm gonna show you how i did it so basically you go to view docs 
and go to custom browser docs okay and what you could do you can just add a new doc here name it the way you want and you're gonna click add the link that we just took from the extension okay and then the next thing is you're gonna go to your main camera where you want to show the chat and you're gonna create a new browser source in this browser source you're gonna go ahead and actually use this single message overlay link go to obs you're gonna bring that link you're gonna name it the way you want click here so you're gonna paste it here personally i use 1920 by 300 but you can make it 1920 by 200 just to make sure it looks like a, a lower third you can always customize the way you want okay anyways so i'm not gonna do it because i already have it it's right here so once you're done it's gonna show up right here okay so once you have this part covered all you need to do we're gonna go ahead and go back to the extension so basically if i click to this extension right here dockable streaming chat link okay so now it's open okay i'm gonna go back to twitch okay this is not my page by any means okay basically what you need to do for you to be able to get the messages you need to go to the chat settings right here and you're gonna click pop out chat okay and as you can see we should have the pop out or the messages coming in minimize this a little bit move it here and if i go to my social stream you can see I got all the messages okay so these all the messages coming from twitch now i was already live streaming on facebook that's why you have my facebook messages but you can see now i have some twitch messages coming in okay so this is very important you need to pop out the chat box to be able to see the messages now if i go to my obs as you can see i'm getting all the messages from twitch right so again, this could be your page. I don't want you to go, you know, take somebody's chat and bring it in into your OBS, but this could be you. So this is the cool part, right? I can choose any message that I want. Just click to it and it's gonna show, boom. You know, as you can see, it's showing, right? Boom. See, I can click to any message that I want and it's gonna show on the screen. And as you can see, it's kind of grayed out, right? So see boom boom if you don't want any message to appear on the screen you can just click clear the current overlay and nothing will be on the screen if you want to create a social chat stream you can do that as well if you want this whole thing to kind of show on the screen you can do that as well by creating a browser source and then let's go it social stream flow okay and let's go ahead instead of using let's go ahead and actually uh, get this link right here i can go to my uh, extension and get the dockable uh, i think this is very very use, uh, useful especially for twitch streamers and i can go here and uh, use this dockable link in here keep it 600 i can resize it to anything you want and then i'm gonna click refresh browser when it source becomes active and then i'm gonna click ok okay as you can see this is super cool so now i can see i have a chat flow right so as people send in messages i mean you can put some backgrounds you can put some sort of background again if you stream on twitch you really know this kind of stuff i can have all the messages coming in and i keep you know playing my game and then you know i can show like if i'm too lazy to kind of show to keep clicking showing each individual message so many options you can be creative and do crazy stuff with this chat overlay extension all right guys so thank you so much for watching this video again uh, put links to other videos if you want to do the same thing for YouTube and Facebook or do everything at once if you're streaming to multiple platforms it's doable as well with this same chat same OBS and for free so make sure you watch the next video on how you're gonna be able to do the same thing for YouTube and Facebook thank you guys for watching and make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my channel but other than that, I'll see you on my next video. Take care.